Hey everybody, it's Jason with J-E-R-R-C. Um, I wanted to go ahead and show you my uh, wheel spacers I have here. Uh, these are currently printed, 3D printed. Um, very strong. It's kind of the way they're the way they're formed and everything uh, to make them nice and structurally sound. Um, they will fit any J Concepts wheels for the, the 2.6. It has a standard six hole pattern, um, such as you know, tribute wheels or the, um, I forget what they're called. But anyways, the regular wheels beside the tribute. And they also work for the, uh, the mega truck wheels as well. And I don't know yet, but they might work for the 2.2s that just came out if they have the same bolt pattern and everything on them. So uh, these come in 25 millimeter length stock with a 5 millimeter spacer to lengthen it out to 30 millimeters depending on the wheel you're running. Um, also comes with, uh, all these come in, in a sets of four. Um, then you also have the spacer that just drops down in. Just a contrast a little bit. It drops down right down inside the wheel to uh, allow that space between, so there's no damage to the rim or the spacer uh, when it's installed. Um, also, the the spacer is built in with uh, three millimeter, which are the bigger holes, and 2.5 millimeters are the smaller holes for your standard hardware that comes with the uh, the wheels themselves. These will also, um, right now, getting prototypes made up um, for uh, 7075 aluminum. So they will be available in aluminum shortly. Um, but I've had such great success with these on my personal rigs that uh, I've decided to uh, sell these. And <clears throat> with these, you'll get a, um, uh, a one time replacement. No questions asked if they get damaged, broken, stripped, whatever. Um, but chances are you'll never need it. But uh, anyways, so they're all set up. These ones here are set up for 6mm um, lugs or hexes that are on these particular wheels. I also have a set set up for um, 4 and a half, which will fit your standard uh, hexes. So it's a little bit shallower so it doesn't hit um, but what I like to do is when I put mine on is typically you have a, a, rec a recess nut there or screw I'm sorry um, and these these here have two set screws which I'm sure everybody's gonna copy once they see this um, and what this does is obviously it locks the hub extender onto the hex so essentially once this is on there even if you're you're central nut was to fall off for whatever reason vibration or what have you um, these would not or should not fall off of the hex so it's locked in on both sides and what I like to do for extra strength and extra protection is find that hole where that one's already there and it's hard to do with one hand because it is a snug fit and you gotta sometimes tap it on And then once it's on, you tighten down your grub screws, turn it, tighten down your other grub screw, and you're good to go. Um, I've had these, not this particular one, but I've had a set on mine, the original prototypes that I did. I um, had them on my truck for probably half a dozen runs right now, and they're still just as, as tight to get on and off as they were when they were brand new. Um, so these will be available on the website at jercustomdesigns.com forward slash shop I'll have these available on the site soon but the the price for these is probably going to be around $35 for a set um, maybe 40 but uh, like I said they'll come with a, a one-time replacement for 
up to four and uh, if you have any issues with them after that then it'll be a case-by-case -case basis but uh, but generally you'll have a, a free one-time replacement for up to four of these so uh, well worth the money like I said that these work better than I anticipated these were originally just supposed to be a prototype for the, the 7075 that are going to be coming out here soon um, but uh, I figured I'd, I'd give these a shot to see if anybody um, was interested. If you are, just hit, hit me up on the page and uh, let me know. I'll have the pricing and everything set on there. Um, but uh, yeah, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me let me know. And uh, stay tuned because uh, I'll have some more stuff coming out here along with the trail my lower trailing arms, upper links, the sway bars. Um, the battery tray and electronics tray set up here so i got a lot of other stuff coming out here very soon and uh, i'll be posting on the page and on the site as they come in all right hope everybody has a good day and uh go out and have some fun with rc